In this video, we will see how to send WhatsApp messages using Microsoft Excel. Note that this technique will be useful for those who want to send the same but customized messages to multiple persons. Take a look at the data in this worksheet. Here I have the list of few friends of mine, their phone numbers and the amounts each of them should pay to our health club. Now let's see how to send a personalized WhatsApp message to each of these guys which will have the name and details of the pending amount. For that, the first step is creating messages in the formula bar equal double quotes hi space double quotes ampersand select the cell containing name ampersand double quotes comma space double quotes ampersand select the cell containing amount ampersand double quotes space is due period space Please pay as soon as possible. Period, double quotes, enter. Name, pending amount. Let's copy the formula into the cells below. See the messages have the name as well as the pending amount. Now to send these messages through WhatsApp. Equal hyperlink function. Open parentheses, double quotes, https, colon, forward slash two times, web.whatsapp.com, forward slash, send, question mark, phone, equal, double quotes, ampersand, select the cell containing phone number, ampersand, double quotes, ampersand, text equal, Double quotes, ampersand, select the cell containing the message, comma, double quotes. Now the text to be displayed in this cell, send message, double quotes, close parentheses, enter. See a hyperlink has been created in this cell. This blue color represents a hyperlink. Let's copy this formula into the cells below. To send this message through WhatsApp, click on the corresponding link. See the default browser of the computer opened. Now using WhatsApp installed on the phone, scan this QR code. Note that once the connection is established between the phone and the computer, WhatsApp won't prompt us for scanning the QR code. Back to Excel. Send message. Message came from Excel to WhatsApp. Click on the send button. See the message got delivered. Again. This technique also can be used to send WhatsApp messages to phone numbers which are not in our contact list. One more example, here this technique is used to send alerts about the renewal dates of insurance policies and subscription services. Now if you want to automate this technique, that can be done using the VP interface of Excel. See, on a single click, WhatsApp started sending messages for multiple persons. We'll discuss about this technique in another video. Until then, thank you for watching and wish you a great day.